Here we have a question that involves a two-way table and goes on to calculate some probabilities from it. So we've got this information in a two-way table. 50 people went to university, so our total of totals is 50. We've got to complete it. This is quite a common question, and usually we need to look for a row or column that only has one space missing. Once we have that, which is this one, let's just highlight that, this column here has one thing missing. So we know the total is seven, we've got four females, so there must be three males. Now that leads us to allow us to calculate um, this one. So this row here, the males row here, now that we've got that three, we know that three plus three in Scotland plus those in Wales plus 19 in England makes 25. So three and 19 is 22, that leaves us three in Wales. And then that allows us to calculate the Wales column, so three and five makes eight. And that allows us to calculate the totals across the bottom here, because there's one gap missing here. I still can't do the England, I still can't do the females. I could do this total here, which is 25, which then allows me to do the females. Or I could do this total here, which is um, 15 for 7 and 8, and therefore we need 35 on top of that to make 50. And then this missing value, I could either do this way, because 4 and 5 makes 9, so we'd have to have 16, or 19 plus 16 is 35. And that's a good tip there. If something is not right, these won't work. So if you do it both ways, um, it won't add up properly if it's made a mistake. So if that is the case, obviously you need to go back and check through all the ones you've calculated to see where you made a mistake. Okay, from that table, we need to pick um, one person at random. Work out the probability that this person went to university in Scotland. So out of all these people, all 50 of them, how many of them went to university in Scotland? So this is a table about you people went to university. Scotland's here, so this the number of people who went to university in Scotland is seven. And there's 50 people in total. And we can just leave it as that, 750. We don't have to cancel it down. It doesn't actually cancel down. We don't have to do anything with it. We don't have to change the decimal. Just leave it as a fraction. Okay, so part two, we're trying to find out one of these people has picked a random. Work out the probability that this is a female who did not go to the university in England. So where are the females that didn't go to university in England? Well, there's one here, or four here in fact. Four females that went to Scotland. Five females went to Wales. So that's nine females out of the total, which is 50. You might be thought, might be thinking that maybe you should restrict it just to the females, so it'd be at 25. But it does say one of these people has picked at random, so it's going back to this whole table, so it's out of 50. One mark for each of those. And I think there was three marks to complete in this table, so you've got um, three marks for all, right? And then it was two marks for four or five, and one mark for two or three. There we go.